it, it's a lot of people on both sides. It's a lot of weapons on both sides. Somebody makes a mistake, a misjudgment, and that can cause a spark that can be hard to stop. This is one of the military demarcation line markers. It is a yellow and black in Hangul, that means Korean, and you can also read in English military demarcation line. Uh, the Korean War, which started in June 1950, ended 27th of July 1953 with an armistice disagreement. And that is the same armistice disagreement that is valid here today. There is no peace between the country, they are technically at war, but uh, the armistice keeps the two countries from fighting each other. We are monitored now from all sides with uh, cameras, both from the south side and from the north. We are here if uh, North Korea would like to start communicating verbally with us. Do you recall the last time there was some kind of a violation? Has there been one in recent years? There are violations uh, every month from either of the sides, and most of them are done by mistake. Uh, mischarges of, uh, of a weapon that goes off and that was not the intention. You know, in the event that we see things escalate, uh, you know, and things start going terribly wrong, what are the actions that you would take in that situation? Of course, we would use all our, our communication um, channels, all our, uh, our possibilities to try to negotiate and to calm down the situation wherever, in, in whatever forum that could be. And of course we all hope that we could close down here and, and go, go home because there is a peace treaty. Um, our nice and good time here in Korea would end, but then we can say mission accomplished, we go home. <laughs>